Hello, fellow paranormal enthusiasts. Welcome to Haunted Antarctica. Now, I know you're thinking, Antarctica? That can't be haunted, but there are supposedly many haunted locations in Antarctica, and on a per capita basis, Antarctica is supposedly the most haunted place in the world. But Antarctica also has a temporary population of at most around maybe 2,000, so take that for what you will. So let's get started. First up is the Wordy House on Winter Island. It is near the Ukrainian Vernadsky Research Base and was named after the Scottish geologist Sir James Wordy. It was built in 1947 by the British and today it is a tourist destination and is said that the spirits of the explorers who stayed here remain here and are felt throughout the building. Next up is Scott's Hut on Roth Island. Not to be confused with the nearby Discovery Hut, Scott's Hut was established in 1911 by Robert Falcon Scott, who led an expedition to the South Pole on the Terra Nova expedition. Scott and four of his men set out and made it to the South Pole in January of 1912. Sadly, they all perished in the cold, snow-covered landscape trying to get back to the hut. The hut was later used in 1915 to house the maroon crew of Ernest Shackleton's expedition after their ship, the Aurora, broke apart offshore. Today, the hut is a popular tourist destination, and many people have claimed getting very uncomfortable feelings from inside the hut. Thirdly, we have the old whaling station in British Base on Deception Island. This old whaling station in abandoned British Base was abandoned due to volcanic eruption. It is said to have ghostly apparitions wandering around, odd lights appear, and disembodied voices are heard around the area. And number one is the McMurdo Station and Mount Erebus on Ross Island. McMurdo Station is a U.S. research station on Ross Island, and it is the largest station in Antarctica. In 1979, a sightseeing plane from New Zealand crashed into the nearby Mount Erebus north of the station. All 257 passengers on board were killed, and today, you can supposedly see ghostly figures wandering around the island basin mountain, and also people get sensations of being watched at McMurdo Station. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not like and share the video? It would be much appreciated. Also, if you're on Twitter, why not follow me on Twitter at the Ghost Watch? I'm also on Twitch at Madfire Gamer. And if you want to see more of my content, why not subscribe and follow for my paranormal activity? And I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.